So as 2022 is done and we are currently cruising well into 2023, I wanted to make this quick video talking about what the plans and the goals for the channel will be in this beautiful, it's not going to be beautiful, it's probably going to be, it's probably going to be as or even worse than 2022 honestly since 2016 when they uh, did a bad thing to Harambe it's it's been going downhill that was that's my per personal favorite conspiracy theory right whatever um so I don't know if you've noticed but I've posted quite a lot of videos um, recently my comeback has been in full motion since October late October um, even though I made my quote-unquote return in, in the summer with the BMW reveal video, my true comeback has been, has been late autumn to now. It would have been better if I did my comeback a bit earlier, obviously, so I don't lose my partnership, but that doesn't matter. But me losing my partnership leads me right into the goals for 2023. So by the month of May, my goal is to get 4,000 watch time hours so I can get my partnership back. The reason I've given myself essentially five months is because the way watch time counting works on YouTube is it takes your last 12 months. So essentially right now, a lot of my non-uploading, non non-active uh, months are still being counted and as such is going to take a bit of time to push beyond those 4,000 hours at which I will become eligible again for a partnership. And my second goal is to average is to average more than 20,000 monthly views again by the month of May. In my opinion, both of these goals are quite achievable, but I still need to work for them, which is important when you set goals. I could be ridiculous and set a uh, and just be like, yeah, I just want to upload like one video every month. No, some shit. I don't know, man. <laughs> So I want to talk about what kind of content you can expect on the channel for the coming year. I will be focusing quite hard on real life car content as I've been for the past few months. Especially now that we have a garage space, essentially a lot of hijinks and a lot of ridiculous videos can come out of that space. Like the oil changing video, which is uh, honestly one of my, definitely one of the best videos I've made just from you know the the content itself it, it was just absolutely ridiculous the, the things we did in in that video especially the oil pouring whatever man and we will mostly be working on mine and george's bmws the e46s and maybe some work on the lancia and george also has a honda civic so quite a few cars to work on now essentially we're going to be doing mostly maintenance maybe some modifications we don't know <laughs> no real plans something will happen the content will come out of that place i also have a few car reviews lined up for the year uh those were my main car content back in the day and i think all of those videos were quite funny highlights being the bmw 320ci and the the audi a6 video so i intend on bringing those back as well now let's talk SLRR. So SLRR will continue to be present on the channel with me enjoying speed running and you guys seemingly enjoying um, watching me speed run. I definitely do think there is a place for SLRR on, on my channel still. And who knows, I might actually bring back more pack reviews. But my goal is to give or take drop a SLRR speed run video every month. And to set goals, my current SLRR speedrun goal is to get a run under one hour. So yeah, expect SLRR as well on the channel. So one new thing I started doing in 2023 is uploading YouTube shorts. And I mean a lot of YouTube shorts. And I've got a lot of YouTube shorts already rendered and uploaded and scheduled for the rest of January. Essentially, a while back I just dipped my toes into the making of the YouTube shorts with dedicated shorts video but then i realized i can actually cut up existing videos into shorts and that way i can boost the viewership of the sh of the original video using the shorts obviously a small percentage of people would transition from the short to the to the full video to the original video but still even a small percentage that's still a win in my books plus shorts do bring in a hefty amount of views so my goal for 2023 is to continue making YouTube shorts, continue making dedicated YouTube shorts, continue cutting up existing videos, continue whilst editing to select clips for YouTube shorts. And another idea 
another bright, another bright, great idea that I personally came up with is to go back through my video catalog to all my old great videos and start selecting parts from them to upload as YouTube Shorts. That way my channel keeps constantly being active, which is a very good thing, especially since I'm, especially since I'm trying to get back into the game and get back into those 4,000 watch time hours. Even though, for a fact, Shorts do not count for watch time hours. Not that it would matter as most Shorts are between 10 and 50 seconds. It's not going to do much. But that doesn't matter, it's still good for the channel and I actually do enjoy making the dedicated cutting up and now I'm probably going to enjoy, enjoy reliving old videos, trying to make them into shorts. The last thing I want to talk about is a possible, probable future channel that I'm planning. Well, planning like in my head, nothing's actually been done, but everything is like in my mind, I, 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 I envisioned this channel. So essentially what I want to do is a Bulgarian speaking Zerga channel. The reason is, over the last few months I've made a lot of videos that have a large amount of Bulgarian in it and I and I cut a lot of the Bulgarian from those videos because they're going to be absolutely pointless if it's just the whole video with subtitles. So because I have all that raw footage of us speaking Bulgarian, I was like, why don't I make some Bulgarian car content and I'm and make a Bulgarian car channel? But I don't know when that will happen as this will be time consuming, even though I don't plan on it being a very large focus of my uh, you know time, as I also have a secret third channel that uh, um, it's that's about CSGO. It's CSGO gameplay, make talking with a friend, essentially. But it's in Bulgarian, so I, I have never shared it. it, it irre irrelevant. I don't know what I'm talking. I don't know what I'm saying here. But yeah, that's also in the works. Maybe, maybe not. Who knows? Essentially, that's all I wanted to say. Thank you for watching, and uh, see you in the next one. The next one is going to be an SLRR video.